place God first through prayer, praying for and with one another. Our second conversation focused on sharing our faith journey and in so doing to be strengthened as we hear others' faith journeys and also the opportunity for us to be able to say in word how Christ has touched our lives and of course in so doing to deepen our understanding and our relationship with Christ and of course with those we share this journey with. Our third conversation focuses on the mission and ministry of Jesus Christ through the mission and ministry of our daily lives. How does what you do as a mom further the ministry of Jesus Christ through nurturing your family, through guiding your children? Dads, as being head of the household in caring for your family, in being close to your spouse, caring for her, as a single person in your workplace, as a student in high school, college. Whatever it is that you do, it has a direct impact, if you reflect on it, on the mission and ministry that Jesus has given to his church, that we are truly to be the hands and feet of Jesus Christ in the world today. We are the ones who are meant to carry on his ministry, which happens not just in formal ministry, but informal ministry as well. How many of us share at the community kitchen, down at the Thurston County Food Bank, the men's shelter, St. Vincent de Paul, however it might be, to reflect on what we do in our everyday lives as sharing and furthering the mission of the church, which is ultimately to evangelize, to spread the good news and to invite others into a life redeemed by Jesus Christ. So my prayer is, is as you continue these three conversations, not only now, but into the future, that you will find your life enriched as you listen to others and as you share how your life furthers the mission of Jesus Christ. God bless you as we place God first.